In today's video, we're going to be fixing Leicester City. Right now, we're sitting bottom of the Premier League table with one point. We're going to change that and win the Champions League in today's video. And there's going to be a twist, a very big twist. Look at Jamie Vardy right now, 72 rated, age 18. This guy has potential to be special. And now with Jamie Vardy being a wonder kid, I've gone ahead and changed the potential from 86 to 99. Okay, then, so we're going to have some fun in this rebuild right now. Again, Leicester struggling in real life, bottom of the table, one point. Jamie Vardy in this rebuild is 99 overall age 18 so again we're going to see him grow and become an even better player than he is right now so we're looking forward to it don't forget drop me a like down below hit the subscribe button and let's get into it and so talking to the team then let's find out what we are working with in this leicester side now one problem straight away Vardy 72 rated we've got ian Acho and we've got daka so start seven games these two are going to start playing ahead of him we're going to try and get rid of them ian Acho probably look to sell him daka get him out on loan so i don't really want to get rid of him but I can't have them in the squad because Vardy just won't get game time. So the rest of the team, midfield, pretty happy with. Albrighton, probably look at maybe replacing him. Perez getting on a bit now as well, 28. Barnes, want to keep him. Justin, want to keep him as well. Play both wings, both wings, both fullback positions, left back and right back. Centre back is where we have a problem. Goalkeeper, we've got a problem. Again, Tielemans, do I play him in cam? I believe he can play it pretty well, but I think Tielemans here... Madison there. Why Why wouldn't we set up like that? And one of the reasons then Leicester are in the situation they're in right now, bottom of the table, they didn't spend any money in the summer transfer window. So you know what? This first season, we're not going to spend any money. We're going to sim it, see how we do. Hopefully we stay up, then we'll start making changes. But before we do go ahead and start simming games, I think one thing we have to do, get Jamie Vardy on a development panel. Let's have a look at his stats right now. You guys wouldn't have seen these as of yet. Here's how we're looking. I think we knew Jamie Vardy would have high pace as a youngster. Again, finishing isn't quite there. Passing, not really there. Dribbling's okay, but again, realistically right now, we could convert him to a winger. But I want to give him as a striker. So Poacher, let's get him on that. And hopefully we'll see him grow. And like I said, for Iheanacho and Daka, I've got to get them out of the side. Otherwise, Jamie Vardy just won't get game time. I want him playing every single game. So Iheanacho, I need to transfer list Daka. I want to loan him out. I don't want to lose him. Then for a backup, I might just have to recall one of these players. And straight away, then we get loads of offers coming in. Daka alone, that's what I'm looking for. West Ham, not ideally where I want to loan him, but I'm going to go ahead and accept. Iheanacho to Ajax, interesting one. Again, let, let's get him sold. Anyone else, I'm not really looking to sell anyone because we're not buying anyone. And now here is then how the team is looking after we got on deals sorted. Iheanacho in the end, guys, I just released him. Ajax, the deal fell through, so released him from the team. But here's how the team's looking. Hurst had to recall him. Because we need a backup striker. But he won't start over Vardy. That's the most important thing. So let's start seven games. I'm hoping Ward in goal will we'll, we'll do okay. Let's have a see then how we get on in our first game here against Fulham. Hoping for the win away from home. 3 no defeat. Wow. Okay. Everton. Okay, we get a win. We get a win. We could be in for a long video here. We could be in for a very long video. Southam. Another defeat. Another defeat. And guys, we've got all the new transfers as well. Everyone. Aubameyang to Chelsea. Nunes to Liverpool, everything, every transfer. Wow, this is um, this is going to be difficult. And that is then how the last month ended. Defeat to Brentford. Could that mean our relegation? Let's find out. Wow, okay, no. 15th place, no signings. A 72 rated Jamie Vardy up front. 11 games won. I'm pretty happy with that. Three teams relegated, Forest, Palace and Bournemouth. Let's have a quick look then how we did in the cup competitions this first season. FA Cup, okay, they made a final. They made a semis, quarters, no. Okay, nowhere decent. Carabao Cup, do we make a final? Forest won it. Forest, Sutton United. Wow, okay. I don't know what. Wow, okay. I don't know where we ended up, but fair, fair play to Forest and Sutton United for making the final. It's a good job then, guys, that we have mods available. Because look at this right now. Born expectations. That was never going to happen. Reached the FA Cup final. Europa League spot in, in the Premier League. Wasn't going to happen. But the main thing right now is have a look at the squad. Okay, Jamie Vardy, 77 rated. Got a five in the first season. Goals, 17. You know what? 17 goals for a player that's gone from 72 to 77. Quite happy with that. Barnes chipping in 13 goals to the sister. Tielemans of 8, Barnes with 7. And now here we are then at the start of Season 2. Abamyang picking up player of the month last season. How much do we have to work with? 86 million. Wow, okay, we can definitely sign some players. Goalkeeper position is the first player I'm signing. But let's have a look then through the team. We know Vardy, 77. Madison, 84. Tielemans getting a minus 6. Going to have to put him to centre mid. There we go. That sorts that out. Okay, so I think goalkeeper, centre-back is definitely needed. Again, Justin, I think we can ride the wave with him another season. Then I think after that, get a left-back in and he dropped down to the bench. Castagne, can he play left-back? He can. And he's got five-star weak foot. Castagne should have been in the first team. Should have been in the first team. Apart from that, Barnes 83 now, which is good to see. Perez, again, a right mid. We could do with one. But I think first, goalkeeper. Okay, so I'm looking through these goalkeepers right now. And we know Forrest got relegated last season. Palace did as well. I can't remember the other team. 
But I think right now, Dean Henderson, is he still... He might have been on loan, actually. Dean Henderson, is he at Forest? He is at Forest. We could sign him. Oh, no, he's at United. He's on loan. He's on loan. Never mind. Never mind. And so after one season, and everybody wants to sign James Justin. Like, I know he's a decent left back. Don't get me wrong. But why does everybody want to sign him? Newcastle, Lazio coming in off a player swap deal. Atletico trying to come in as well. I'm not trying to sell him. Now, it wasn't only Dean Henderson then I sent a scout report out for. A couple of other players as well. But I think Dean Henderson, guys, he made the move to Forest because he weren't the first goalkeeper at United. They've still got David De Gea. I think we sign him. I think we go ahead and sign him. We've got the money to do it. Let's do it. And a good thing with Dean Henderson as well. Only 26. So this guy can be our first team goalkeeper throughout this whole video, which is perfect. Premier League experience already after being at Forest. So that's what we want. I'm going to go straight in. 26. 26.5. Yeah, let's go 26.5. Smith. That's not what I wanted. That's not what I wanted. That's not what I wanted. Okay, now we're a week later. Let's try again. Not 265,000. What am I doing there? Okay, transfer fee. Right, two. Uh, t t what am I doing? 26 million. 26 million. Why, why, why can't I play FIFA all of a sudden? 26.5 million. Now we've got a real offer on the table. They want 35.8. Fair play, United. Fair play. I'm going to go 32. Again, I kind of want to bring in a centre-back as well. We will have the money to do that. 32. And there we go, we agree a deal. Okay then, so while we're simming ahead to the next week, we've had an offer here for Jamie, two offers in for Jamie Vardy already. 33.6 million. Wow, he's worth a lot already. Again, let's reject it. In fact, let's just block. Okay, what? Move, we're requesting to move away. And so things right now just aren't playing sailing. What's happened? Submit a transfer request. Why? Why have you... There's no information on this. If he does leave, guys, I'll just buy him back. Because I don't get why this has happened. And I did say that before we finish this window with the rest of the money, I wanted to sign a centre back. Nico Slotterbeck from Dortmund is the player I'm looking for right now. We can definitely afford him. Let's get it done. I'll tell you what, guys, Dortmund do well. Too well. Like they're asking for 50 mil here. 50 mil. 47.7. Try and get a deal over the line. And we do. Okay, let's see how the team is looking now with the new signings. There we go. Looking a lot better at the back right now. Slotterbeck, Henderson. We should be able to work our way up the table now. I don't think there's enough money left in the bank to sign a right mid, like a quality right mid. I'm going to wait till next season. Vardy is going to continue improving. Madison is unhappy right now. Probably a new contract. Same with Ndidi. And I'll get that sorted out. And the funny thing is, I can't even recall Daka right now. Because he's gone up by two in his overall. So the returns, he's playing more than Vardy. Going to have to wait. Going to have to wait even longer. And now here we go then, once again. Again, this season, what, we finished 15th last season. I'm looking for top half finish this season. I know it's a big jump. But even if we just finish 10th, that's quite a bit of an improvement. Again, quality goalkeeper coming in, quality centre-back coming in, and it's not working at the minute. It, okay, we won against Liverpool. We won against Liverpool. So you know I said to you guys how I wanted to finish in the top half this season. Well, you're going to find out where we actually finished. Okay, not 12th. Arsenal finished 12th. Quite surprising. West Ham, 10th. Leeds, Newcastle, Aston Villa. Finished 6th. 6th this season is... A Pretty good season for us. And so a good finish then in the Premier League. Let's see how we did in the FA Cup. Did we... Okay, no, Chelsea Luton Town making the final. i tell you what, it's good to see these smaller teams, so to speak, smaller teams, making, you know, semi-finals and finals, quarter-finals even. It's, it's pretty good. Cairo Cup, did we make... No, Norwich... Okay, wow. We're not doing too good in these cup competitions. But now before we do go ahead and finish off top scorer... Okay, I was about to say, Jamie Vardy, not a top scorer... I'm very surprised. Very surprised. Harvey Barnes, 21 goals. So this guy carried us to sixth place. Vardy, 12 and 0 assists. I'm getting a little bit worried. Now, here we are in season three. And one thing straight away I can notice, Vardy away with England, which is pretty good to see as well. You can see his stats right there. He is really developing. His sprint speed, 98. 98 sprint speed. He's finishing, however, 89. Okay, that's, that's really good. Let's find out then how much have we got. 56 million. Okay, seems a little bit less than last season. Again, we can move the wages down. We don't need all of that in the wages. So probably working out 75 million. It's, it's a good starting point. And one thing that's good as well that will help us this season, Daka is back. He's back from his loan, 81 rated. So he's come back a better player. Also, we can go on the bench now. He shouldn't start ahead of Vardy. In terms of signings, I think right mid, we've got to do that first. And so we do have then around about 75, 80 million to spend on the right mid. Now, the RB is still Leverkusen. I feel like he can come here, no problem. We can afford him, but I need a winger for the bench as well. Now, Draxler, free agent. Do I pick him up? Do I pick someone up like Kubo, Williams? We'll see how much we've got left after this deal. I'm going to begin then with 65. Do you want 73.5? Can Will they not take any less than that? Maybe 68.5? Will he accept that? Because I think it's on the last year of his contract. 68.5, and we get a deal. Okay, so one problem we have with the DRB signing. Now, I can't really talk about problems, but DRB is great on the left, but cutting in from the right, I don't think he'll be able to do that as good because his shooting, his finishing, 
80? Okay, it's decent. It's better than I thought it was. Because, of course, being left-footed on the right, he can cut in. But I didn't know how well he could finish. Again, Barnes could probably do it. Five-star weak foot. What's his finishing? Yeah, you know what? I'll put DRB in his natural position. Barnes on the right. Yeah, now we need a winger for the bench. So I'm kind of in two minds right now. Do we go for Julian Draxler? Again, great player. Even though he's age 30, he's free. But Kubo, I kind of want to bring him in. But Draxler, I can't really give up on this player. Again, free. Won't cost any transfer budget. Just wages. And now we have it in, guys. Draxler, I've done it. He is in to the team. Let's take Ward off. Again, I don't really need two strikers on the bench. We'll have a look at the bench now. But this is how it's looking. Do I need another midfielder? Probably not. Could maybe sign another winger. Do I need to sign another winger? Is the question. Two midfielders, two defenders. You know what? I might sign that extra midfield, that extra winger. Because Draxler can come on at Cam. Then I need a winger off the bench anyway to place Barnes or DRB. So I just tried to go in and tried to sign Kubo. That didn't happen. I was, I literally got shown the door. He didn't want to discuss after the offer I put in. You can see we're kind of limited in what we can do. So I'm going to offer Perez in the deal. Transfer fee, 10 million. It's a little bit over his value, but I want to get the job done here. Submit the offer. He might want a sell-on clause, but let's see if we get this deal done. And there we go. And there we have it. And the final transfer is done. Let's get him onto the bench again. Hurst, probably loan him out again, to be honest. Don't really need him. Williams comes in, and this is how the team's looking now. We're going to try and break into that top four, and I think this team is definitely possible. So far, then, things are going to plan. we got a top four finish, which is what we wanted. Ten points behind Man City, beating Liverpool on goal difference. And now this season, then, we was in the Europa League. Going to show you guys where we finished in that competition, but FA Cup first. Let's have a see. Still, still. Okay, we made the semi-finals. Better, but still no win. Carabao Cup, final. We made the final, but Liverpool beat us semis. We beat Man City. But lost to Liverpool, guys. And so in the Europa League, we didn't make the final of that. Semi-finals, didn't make the semi-final. Quarter-final, yeah, we got knocked out to Dortmund. 5-2. But overall, and I think we had a good season. Again, finishing the top four. Champions League football next season. Transfer budget, we've got £9. Man City have offered us a job. So we must be doing something right here at Leicester. But before we finish off, Vardy, 88. Vardy's now 88 rated. No wonder. No wonder. Top scorer, Vardy, 29. This guy got up by six this season. The RB17, really good uh, debut season. Madison 16, Barnes 50. Put up good numbers, Barnes. 10 assists as well. Pereira 12, Tielemans 11. So all round, good performance. And here we are then at the start of a new season. Now this season could be our final season here at Leicester. Again, we could make Champions League final. We could play it and we could win. Who knows? We'll, we'll, we'll look at the team. Again, Vardy 88, can't believe that. The RB89, Tielemans 89. Again, the team is really growing. Madison, like him a little bit higher, but 85 is okay. Sunchu, I think we need to improve that right now. Castagne, we could maybe look at doing improving that. Could, again, drop Castagne down to the bench. Williams, 81. Daka, 82. Draxler hasn't dropped in overall, so we're looking good. Once again, and let's have a look. How much have we got? There you go. 134 million. So I think what we do, we go out, we sign a centre-back, we sign a better left-back. If there isn't one, Castagne is fine. And then apart from that, maybe the bench could do with improving a little bit. But again, where do you improve the bench? Maybe a better centre-back? I, I don't really know. In fact, then, considering we're talking about centre-backs, let's have a see. Wesley Fofana should be bringing back to the club. Has he increased in his overall? How's he doing? He's at Roma. He's at Roma. You know what? Let's scout him. Let's take a look. And here he is then, guys. Wesley Fofana is only 82 rated. Now, I was going to look to bring him in, but he's no better than Soyuncu. And... Okay, is there any reason to bring him in? I feel like we can do better. And so we're going big right now on a centre-back. want to bring him in from Roma. And no, it's not Wesley Fofana. We're going a little bit better. And it's going to be a Rojo. 87 rated. If I can bring this guy in. Right foot centre-back. Can play right back if needed. That would be perfect. I'm going to go in with 87. Something like that. Let's just submit the offer. See what Roma say. Could be overpaying a little bit, but I don't mind. Okay, no. I'm not overpaying. I'm not overpaying. Uh, let's go 110. I don't mind a salon clause because they're going to want that. 110. And we agree a deal. And now that we've got a Rojo through the door, so you can actually drop down to the bench. So we don't need another centre-back. Let's get him into the team. A Rojo comes in. Left-back, we're going to see if there's anyone out there. But if not, don't mind keeping Castagne. Okay, so I've been scouting around everywhere for a left-back. And I mean everywhere. Every single league, more or less, now ended up in the Eredivisie. Looking at Ajax, see who they brought in. Owen Vindel, 84 rated. Only one rated higher than Castagne. But I think he's four years younger. So I'm going to try and bring him in right now. Just going to go straight in with 40 million. That way then... Vindel comes in. Castagna drops down to the bench. The bench is even stronger. So it makes sense. Okay, we might not be able to afford him. Um, <laughs> saying all this, we might be able to afford him. 15%, submit that. No money left over. I'll sort something out around that. No. Wow, okay, we can't. The only thing I could do in this situation is offer a fullback, uh, Luke Thomas. Propose. Let's try and save a little bit of money here. Try and drop that down to 45. That gives us 80k. Need a bit more money than that. Drop down to 42. Submit the offer. See what you say. 
Okay, they're, they're gonna agree. I'm not gonna lie then. I'm very surprised we managed to get our deal over the line. I really didn't think we could. But Castagne, Vindo comes in. Again, Castagne down to the bench now. You can play the odd game. I think you can play both, can't you? Yeah, right back, left back. So we'll get game time. Here's how the team's looking. Pretty happy with it. Let's see how we do in the Champions League. And now before we do get into the games, I want to show you guys our group. Champions League. Okay, Napoli, Dortmund, Dynamo Zagreb. It's a difficult group, let's be honest. But with the team we've got, the quality, we should just about make it out. Just to give you guys an update then, we did make it out of the group. Top of the group, 14 points. Yeah, pretty strong from us. Round of 16 right now. We're into second leg. Beat Atalanta 2-1. We're into second leg. Let's see how we do right now when we sim this. Hope we make it through the team. Vardy now 90 rated. Atalanta's team, pretty good. Sim this, please. Please make it through, Leicester, please. There we go. Madison and uh, Pereira with the goals. And then to our second knockout game, we're taking on Real Madrid. Look at their side. They've got Anthony in their team. De Bruyne is in their team. Wow, let's just sim this. Let's just see how we do. Okay, 3 2. That's not as bad as a thought. That is not as bad as a thought. I guess being at home, I expected to win, but we still have a chance. And now here we have then the second leg. Let's get into simming this. Will we make it through? Will we make it through? That is the big question right now. Come on, Leicester. Come on, Leicester. There we go. Okay. 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 I'm liking the look of this. I am liking the look of this. Vardy with two goals. The RB coming in. And there we go. We smash Real Madrid and we make it through. We are now about to play the second leg of the semi final against Bayern. Let's have a look at the other teams in here. Okay, Chelsea and Man City. Man City 5-3. So, Man City made it through. 1-1 one, one right now against Bayern. Let's see. Here we go. Come on. Come on. Did it against Real Madrid. Bayern's team. Interesting. Really, really interesting. Oh, oh Barnes. No. I have to replace him. Let's see who comes on. 1-0. I'll do that. Who? Come on. Don't matter. Rojo with the goal. So, that means, of course, then we're taking on Man City in the final. We're going to play that pretty soon. But first, Premier League. Where do we finish? Fifth place. Okay. Bit of a drop-off. Bit of a drop-off. Not going to lie. But of course, plenty of games this season went quite far in the Champions League. Brighton making top four. Newcastle making... Wow, okay. That top four looks completely different to what we're used to. FA Cup. How do we do? How do we... Okay, we won that. 2-1. So extra games in the FA Cup and Champions League. Carabao Cup. How do we do? Okay, we didn't make the final. Didn't make the semis. Okay, quarterfinals. That's not too bad. So played plenty of games this season. And now going into the final, we won't have Owen Vindal. That's not good. We signed him in to play him. Castagne looks like you're playing. That's not a problem. Again, I didn't mind him. Top scorer this season, Vardy, 32, 90 rated. Again, he does have a potential of 99, but just not got there just yet. Uh, Madison, 21, much better this season from Madison. I was kind of disappointed so far, but 21, 18 from Barnes, another good season. Top assistant, Tielemans, Madison are up there. This is not good. This is not good right now. Owen Vindal, where's Castagne gone? Where is Castagne? He's, no long, he's not in the team. He's gone. Uh, we've got a problem. We have got a problem right now. Um, who do I play left back? I have, don't have a clue. Who do I play left back? I have no, I have no idea. So I'm thinking then for the final, we change formation because I, I don't have another left back in the team. So it's impossible. No one that can really play that on my team. Yeah, he can't even play there. So right now, I want another strike on the team. Daka's going to come in. I just, no, Daka's going to come in and play with Vardy up front. These two are going to link up, hopefully. Vindal's going to have to make way. Let's just get Chowdhury off the bench. Uh, Amati, let's do it like that. And now here we go then. Here's how both teams are going to line up going into this Champions League final. I had to change formation, which is no problem. Man City's team, yeah, it's, it's looking okay. I mean, Lindley in there, I don't really imagine him being there. Again, the midfield, no De Bruyne, he's at Real Madrid. But Harland up front, he's easily 94, 95 rated now, so... Let's hope he doesn't score. Okay, here we go then, guys. It all comes down to this game right now against Man City. I'm pretty confident. Again, our team looks pretty good. I also swatched, uh, swatched, uh, switched the RB and Barnes around. The RB's now on the left, Barnes on the right. Let's see how we do. Again, I think Man City here. I think we definitely, definitely should win this game. Okay, one back. Madison, let's get running. Let's get running. Here we go, Jamie Vardy. Actually, right, so go on, cross that in. Okay, okay. He, over the years, over the years, he's crossing just... Hasn't been a thing that's improved. There we go. The RB, we're away. Okay, maybe we're not away. Maybe we're not away. Madison, looking for a big game from you. I need the assist. You've got two strikers up there to support. Alvarez, and it's 1-0. And it's 1-0 to Man City. Okay, okay. That's not how we start. That is not how we need to start. Alvarez, yeah, again, he's really grown. I bet he has now as well. What? He probably started at, what, 79 rated? Five, four, five seasons in. This guy's easily high 80s now. Again, Man City working the ball well, like they normally do. Played up 1-2 with Alvarez. Henderson stood no chance. we go, the RB inside. Tielemans. Daka just looking for the run. Actually, we're going to... Okay, Vardy's took it. That's fine. That actually works out better. Inside, Daka. And it's 1-1. And it's 1-1. As quick as that. Madison with the assist. I, get, I said, he's got to have a big game. He's got to have a big game here. Daka with a goal. I'm kind of glad we kept him in a way. Because 83 rated backup striker is pretty solid. 
And Vardy being 90 rated, we, we can't drop him. And now them two are playing together. I was thinking to go Vardy and Barnes up top together, but I think we'll go like this for now. Because again, we don't really have many options on the bench. But there we go, 1-1. One, one. Just need to get back. Just need to get back and defend this. Slotterbeck. Okay, Alvarez. Oh, I've shield. Yeah, Tielemans. There we go. Shielded the pass. Ended perfect. There we go inside. DRB, that's great. Actually, back out wide to DRB. He's got the pace. The only problem is with Dakar and Vardy. Crosses in. Are they going to get any headers on these? I just don't think they are with the height. Oh, no. We need to get back. We need to get back. We're in trouble right now. Haaland. Get across him. Get across. Slots of... No. That's fine. Just clear it. There we go. Tielemans, row away. Row away. Vardy, just get on that and turn. Dakar's through. Dakar, go on. Just run. Just run, Dakar. I don't know what sprint speed is. But oh, Madison in the centre. Madison's making a run. Hits it first time. Not beating any some of that. The thing is to Haaland, I don't know to go to him or to, ju to just drop off and just hope that he plays the pass. I don't, I don't really know what to do. Oh, no. Cancelo. No. Cancelo with his new number seven as well. Okay. It's hard time. And it's still 1-1. Oh, I had that on. Oh, he's done so well. Barnes. Vardy. Back out to Barnes. But this is where I need help. Barnes, he'll drag that back. Options in the box. Finish. Madison. Is that about post? Is that about post? Dakar. Um, looking for the pass. That's fine. Looking to get this into the path of Vardy. And we do. Vardy. Oh, I was hoping for something. Vardy. What? Do you guys... Okay. Okay. I'm going to say. Did you guys see that? He had the ball and then just gave up. The RB crossed in. Okay. We can actually get this. Tielemans. Passes on. Madison. Oh, you know what, Madison? You know what? Curl it in. Go on. Maybe a bit too far. We're actually dominating in this game. We're absolutely dominating. As I say that, we, we just give away the ball. <laughs> just give away the ball. No need. 62 minutes in. Again, no changes yet. Fitness levels are okay. Foden now. Oh, this is where I need Pereira running. Okay. We need some help. We need some help. Foden. Oh, that's fine. And did he close it up? Madison plays a good ball inside. Jamie Vardy just going to run at this defense. Jamie Vardy. Jamie Vardy. A little bit far away. Again, I didn't mean to go further away from goal, but to go closer, of course. A corner. Not really got any tall players. I'm going to play this short, actually. Yeah, play this short to Madison. Maybe look for a pass inside if one opens up. That's fine. Oh, I just can't, just can't apply. Just can't apply the finish. Play that back through. Vardy. Vardy. Vardy, maybe. Oh, again. Edison, he's proven hard to beat. 50 minutes to go. Edison, I just cannot beat him, guys. Madison, we're going to play this short again. Just looking for something across the box. It's the only sort of way here. Play that. Slotterbeck. Play that inside. Looking for runners. Arojo. Looking for a pass. No one opening up. Oh, here we go. DRB. Let's go. Let's go. Man City have just had a corner. Didn't make anything of it. Play that. Play that inside. Vardy. Madison. Looking. Just keep running, guys. What, what are we stopping for? DRB. Just keep going. DRB. DRB. Looking for someone. No one. Edge of the box. Madison. Madison looking, passes on, Vardy, and there we go, the winner, Jamie Vardy, our wonder kid, has hopefully scored as the winner here, hopefully is a very big word, I'm not, <laughs> not a big, but you know what I mean, oh, come on, Jamie Vardy, man, I'm, I'm so happy if this is the winning goal, because again, the whole video is sort of centred around Jamie Vardy, and a few other players as well, of course, Leicester, but Jamie Vardy, being the wonder kid, A16, 99 potential, and that man right there could have scored as the winner. There we go. Dakar, just going to run. Just going to run with this right now. Just hold on to it. Okay, taking out Ref. Ref. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Okay, three minutes added on. That's not what I want to see. Where have the three minutes come from? Madison. Okay, just hold on to this right now. Unless I can feed the ball through. Again, there's no rush for us. Rush for Man City. We don't have to rush this. Just look to see how to win. Not looking to play on the back, of course. Um, and did he? There we go. Full time. Full time. We have done it, guys. Fourth seasons, five seasons, I, I honestly can't remember. But the, the, the way we've grown this team from season one, no signings, to constantly, you know, progression. Again, top half finish, top six finish, top four finish, finishing second, of course. Then winning the Champions League against Man City and Vardy scoring the winner. I'm absolutely made up with that. So, if you guys enjoyed it, don't forget to drop me a like down below, hit the subscribe button, and I'll catch you in the next one.